going back to the Jeff Jarrett interview, and listen, I always love it. Um, just I like to sit back as a fan and hear somebody like Jeff Jarrett talking to somebody like Mark Henry. But Jeff Jarrett wanted to hear your reaction at the end of that interview, and he brought up Owen Hart and some of the things that Owen Hart did to you and said to you and the teachings that he gave to you. And you said something during the break that I wanted to bring up on air because I think it's important to share. Um, Jeff Jarrett's going into the Hall of Fame. I know one day, Mark Henry, you're going to be going into the Hall of Fame. Owen Hart, whenever it comes around this time of year, we always talk about Owen Hart going into the WWE Hall of Fame. And I think everybody listening to this show believes that Owen Hart is a Hall of Famer. What did Owen Hart mean to you? Owen Hart was counsel. Um, he was... A teacher first and like a brother to me. He took care of me and, you know, taught me how to relate to the locker room. Nobody ever talked about locker room etiquette. Uh, Owen was that guy. Um, he also, we talked about psychology. Um, we traveled the road together and um, Owen didn't like to drive. <laughs> so he was like, and I like to drive. So it was like a match made in heaven. It was like, you know, okay, I'll jump out and get some food and get back in. Like, we, we just had a real good relationship, especially after I came from Canada in, in 99 and 88 or uh, 98 and 99. And, you know, he just helped me along. And just, just how to handle situations. And uh, there were some issues about me always wanting to fight rather than talk. And he was like, man, you can't beat, beat up everybody. Like, that's not going to solve your problems. And, you know, just like I just listened, you know. And, and like Jeff was saying, like, Owen had a way of lightening a serious moment like nobody in the world. Like, I mean, it was, it was just like he would just start talking about something random and just make the rest of it up. And everybody, all parties, both angry parties would be laughing and shaking hands in a matter of minutes. So he was he was a really, really good peacemaker. And I was saying to you that if I'm ever blessed to be able to uh, go in the Hall of Fame, that I, I would want to go in with my brother. Or I want to at least be able to uh, tell Martha that, you know, whatever the business did to hurt her and the family, um, you know, I want to apologize because Owen would do it for me. And he deserves to be in his rightful place. And that's the Hall of Fame. Do you feel in a lot of ways, because it's funny when you're, you start talking about Owen Hart, um, I, I, you know, just as somebody that knows you, a lot of similar traits to you and Owen Hart. Do you feel like when you were similar to Owen in the locker room? I, I was. I, I tried to make the peace between any issues that was confrontational. Um, whenever somebody did something that was out of character, out of context, I would always address it and give them a way to change it. Okay. You can't just fuss at people. Uh, you got to give people answers and you got to give people options to uh, learn how to get out of a situation or to fix a situation and I, if i've learned anything from wrestling is stuff bad is going to happen it's inevitable it's going to happen you got to deal with it face it don't run from it and say you know what i made a mistake i spent too much money i went out too much i talked to the wrong people i stole it i lied about it whatever you did you have to own it and be like, listen, I need forgiveness. What is it going to take? But teach me how to not get in this situation again and give me options and other options to help my time. So I don't have time for that. So Owen was one of those guys, and I try to be that guy too.